Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down another booster cracking Sunday, and we've got a brand new Force of Will box to crack open. Advent of the Demon King. That's uh, Rhea Cluster number two, I believe. We already opened uh, the first one in this cluster. Uh, I forget the name of it. It's one of the first Force of Wills we did. Uh, but in any case, we've got this one to open. It's in one of these nice thin boxes, which is pretty sweet. It's got some interesting stuff, some cool J rulers, including like a really cool like BA Kung Fu Panda J ruler that would be pretty neat to pull. So let's see what we can find. Oh, there it goes. Get off all this plastic. This might come with a promotional card too, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, yeah, right here in the middle. Yep, pretty cool. We'll open that really quick. Let's see what we can get in this one. I actually don't know what the promotional card is in this one. So let's see. Should have a bunch of like magic stones in here and stuff, I guess. All right. Very cool. Sprinting Flame Horse as our buy a box promo. Pretty neat. And then uh, just a bunch of other random goodies to build a starter deck or something like that. Just a bunch of nonsense, so not too big of a deal. We do have the Treasure Hunter Ferrica, which I believe we got last time as well in our like little buy a box promo thing. I uh, don't know if we got her, though. This is a J-Ruler as well. Martial, Ars Martial Artist Pale Elio. I don't know how to say that. That's crazy. Um, pretty neat. Wow. We actually got a lot of J-Rulers in this. Pretty cool. Uh, which one was this one? Mermaid Shaman for a J-Ruler. All right. All right. Not foil in these. Not foil, but it's still pretty cool. Don't know how much any of those are going for, considering you get them with the box. We've also got Leaf Elder as a J-Ruler. Very neat. And let's see, Blood Sucking Butler, J Ruler. That's our final one. Uh, yeah, that's uh, that's neat. I didn't realize you got so many J Rulers just in this eye box promo thing. But all these are just magic stones. Don't have to worry about them. All right, so we got half this box to open up. Let's get cracking. Nice pull tabs. All right, let's see what we can find. Crystal Devotion. We'll see how these are all set up here. Looks like we got. Rares on the back. Oh, just spoiled that rare. Uh, oh, well, this is a rare too. Panda Queen, the Rose Quartz, which is pretty goofy looking. And then we got a nice common foil. Really cool looking though. Variants, White Dragonoid Child. Are there variants? That's interesting. On to the next one. Child. What is this one? Oh, that's cool looking. Floating Ice. Doctor, Jewel Cutter, Spirit Bug. Water Magen, that's pretty cool. Wouldn't mind getting that one in a foil. Secret Rare, that's nice. Uh, the Golden Bird, a nice eagle. And then at the end, a cool looking Velociraptor common foil. I like these common foils, though. They got these nice full arts on them. I just ripped this card in half. Oops. At least these are good quality cards and they don't rip in half like that. All right, Commons, Corrupted Knights, Bloodsucker Dragon, pretty sweet looking. Uh, Destruction, there's our Rare Willful Samurai Spirit, pretty sweet. And then we got a nice Common Insights. Yeah, I'm really impressed with these uh, foils at the end, these Common Foils. It looks like they one up themselves. Yeah, there we go. White Dragonoid Child is, there's the regular version, here's a variant full art version foil of just a common, which is pretty neat that they did that. All right, Leaf Digger and Fire Wave. Let's see, I'm coming. There's our rare uh, Elixirs Fighting Elixir, Fighting Spirits. All right. And a common angel statue of the tower. Cool. So far, I'm more impressed with the common foils than I am the rares that we're getting. <laughs> All right, Traveling Panda. Copy, Medicine, Corrupt Panda. Lots of pandas in this set. Uh, oh, well, yeah, what is that one? Exorcist, Abin. Oh, look at there. There's Abin of the Demon, Demon King. It's just an uncommon. Uh, set name. There we go. Misty Dragon Spirit as our super rare. Pretty cool looking. And at the end, common Jewel Shell. I once again got a really good price on this set. Normally sells for around 50 bucks. I got it for like 30 uh, so a bunch of these just like went on sale randomly on Amazon. I bought like three boxes because they were just such a good price. The next one we open up is more of a newer set too. And uh, 
I got that one for a steal, but we'll talk about that when we get to it. There's our rare Winds of Gold, another eagle, and then a traveling panda. So nothing crazy yet as far as rares go, I think. I don't think any of those are going to be super crazy. Dragonoid, he's pretty sweet. Should get a full art foil of him, he's cool. All right, there's that Insights. Exorcist, Abnormal Demon King, Duplication Mirror, and that, oh, Duplication Mirror is our rare, I guess. Our super rare Duplication Mirror. There we go. <laughs> Almost passed it, and there's Dark Blades Harvest. All right, we're due for a J-Ruler. We've gotten a lot of super rares and things, but no J-Rulers, so I think it's our time now. Nice Triceratops, that's pretty sweet looking. Golden Bird, also pretty cool. A lot of birds on this set too. There's our rare Voyage of the Floating Isle. And then at the end, we got our first J-Ruler. Let's go, we got Gil, the Gifted Conjurer. Really sweet looking. See the reverse. There's Gil right there. Definitely he's got a nice J-Ruler side. Very cool, very good foil. Boom, I called it. We asked for the J-Ruler and the pack gave. That was very nice. All right, Magic Crest, a little cat, another panda. Blood Ritual, Digestion, oh, there's our rare Possession Stone, that might be worth, a, it might be worth some value, these stones, any type of like rare stones can be worth something, and rare Jewel Golem Foil, very nice, our first rare foil, on to the next one, keep ripping that back card, Panda, Chime, Guardian, Spirit, Envoy, Flood, Spirit again, Meijin, uh, then we got our rare, uh, Lafargy? Yeah, Lafargy, okay, interesting. And then at the end, just a common portal magic. Cool looking card though. Oh yeah, here we go. All right, main madness. At least our camera's been focusing this week, unlike last week for some random reason it didn't want to focus. No trouble this week though. All right, here's our rare. We got two rares actually, we spoiled one. Hilda and Safina is our first one. And we've got Evil Dragon Hellblaze as our foil rare. Really sweet looking. Love the artwork on that one. That one's really cool. On to the next. We got a nice cat on the end. Deadly Housefire, is that the name of that one? Command of Life and Death, Jewel Shell, one and only. Light Meijin. Optional Possession is our rare. And we've got an uncommon foil, the Magic Warrior. He looks sweet too. Man, super impressed with these foils. Alrighty. Let's keep up the grind. Panda. Portal Magic. Looks way better as a full art. Ceaseless Devotion. Dinosaur Surfacing. Unstable Golem. There's an uncommon. And there's our rare. We got Feor, the Rallying King. Very cool. And at the end, ooh, we've got the nice Advent of the Demon King foil. Very cool. This set and the next set, which is a newer one, like I said, uh, I might actually look up any of these, just look up on like TGC player if any of these commons or uncommons might be any value. Some of these newer sets actually do hold value in the common and uncommon slots, depending on what it is, so. Uncommon, rare, oh, super rare, very nice. Viola the Dragon Priestess. Very cool. She should almost be a J ruler, but she's not. Uh, yeah, still sweet though. Ooh, there we go. We got the Magic Crest of Water. That one's a pretty good foil one. Just a common, but it looks sweet. All right, are we due for another J ruler? I think it's uh, been a few packs in now. I think we're probably due for another one. Dinosaur, fast food. Rallying, digestion. Cards are falling. There's our rare Sorceress, Priestess, Seal, or Sael. I don't know. And then we've got, oh yes, yes, we got our super awesome Kung Fu Panda J-Ruler foil. Let's go. What's his name? Tegris Pearlshine, Lord of the Mountain, Super BA Panda J-Ruler. Really cool. Look at that guy. I like his reverse side too. Pearlshine. That's awesome. Straight up Jack Black Kung Fu Panda in this boy. That's sweet. All right. I got the one I wanted. I got the Panda. That's excellent. So now we've got only, what, three packs left? Wow. Can we get one more J-Ruler before it's all over? We'll see. We'll see. We got Wind Majin, Swirling Mermaid. There's our rare Majin Stone. Those are one of the ones that uh, might be worth like a buck or something. 
And we've got Uncommon Elven Exorcist. Very sweet. Two more packs. Can we clutch up on the last pack for J-Ruler? I, I have my doubts that it's in this one. If anything, it's going to be in that last one. Let's see. Burning. Uncommon. Rapunzel is our rare. Just a Resonator Fairy Tale rare. Oh, oh. There we go. Uncommon Foil. Fire Wave. Last pack. What will we find? One more J-Ruler to close us off here. That's what we want. Sleepy Cat Spirit. Lowly... Is that lonely? Lowly Spirit Bug. Dispersal. Command of Life and Death. Dark Health. Fugitive. Diver Panda. Faith in the Darkness as our rare. Pretty cool looking card. I like that one. And on the end, do we have something good? Nah, just an uncommon bird. Does look pretty sweet though. Just an uncommon. I mean, just look at how cool all these foil full arts look like. That was such a good choice on their part to do this. These look just really nice, really nice. And it's so awesome that you get one in each pack. It's just really nice. All right, here's our pulls of the day. I've got our two stones that we pulled so far. I definitely think they'll hold a little bit of value, at least a buck, I'm hoping. Uh, we've got Duplication Mirror. This is my underdog one that might be worth some value. I'm thinking uh, it could hold some. We got a nice uh, rare dragon, maybe not worth that much along with these two. Uh, these two, they look super sweet, but they usually never hold value. Any of like these just basic rare character type ones, they're usually like the dopest looking cards, but they don't hold a lot of value. Uh, and then of course, at the end, we've got our two J rulers. We'll see how much those go for, but yeah, those are our pulls for the day. Let's see uh, on screen now our totals of what we're at so far halfway through the box. Make sure to stick around for next week. We'll finish up the rest of the box and put our totals all together and see how we did. Uh, make sure to leave a like. Make sure to leave a comment and subscribe so you don't miss next week's episode. And we will see you guys then.